Why, hello everyone. Welcome back to Playframe and to Elden Ring and side quest and all that. Uh, we will be back in Kaelid in a moment. I just realized I forgot a couple of things. Imagine me forgetting something. Two things, actually. The first thing is actually something that I've been able to do for a couple of episodes now, probably. I think... Uh... Boom. All right. Yeah. I forgot that I had three seeds now. And so now I've got an extra charge. And actually, I'm going to... Yeah, let's go eight and two for now. And I may eventually swap it to seven and three. Just because there are some more things I'm using from time to time. Other thing is we need to get Topes uh, his key. We almost forgot Topes. In fairness, I think if anybody in this game would uh, fully understand us forgetting them, it would be Topes. But, uh, let's get the guy his key and probably doom him in so doing. Have a key. Back to learn another. Why, of course. Here you go. Are you certain you're willing to give your glintstone key to me? My, oh my. Thank you. Thank you dearly. Now I can go back to the academy to resume my study of glintstone sorceries. And the very stars. <laughs> Ooh, now there's a pose that I know something to do with. Back to learn another. No, Why, I... Of course. Uh, about that. Thank you dearly. With your blessing, I will depart for the Academy of Rhea Lucaria. Perhaps one day you'll pay me a visit. Who knows? I may be a decorated sorcerer by then. <laughs> We're gonna just like find you dead on the front steps, aren't we? Uh, well, best of luck, Topes. Thank you very much for the pose. That's more valuable than anything, honestly. Uh, <sighs> don't want to spend too long doing this, but I just really don't expect that he's going to make it very far. You know? And I definitely don't want to scope out the entirety of the Academy to find him, but, uh... Yeah, he's not there anymore. Hmm. Well, here. We'll, we'll do, like, the fast version. Let's, uh... I will warp to each of the... Uh... I will warp to each of the... Grace fires in the vicinity. And... Just look around the immediate surroundings to see if he's chilling there. And if not, I can come back later. Again, I just... We got Caleb's stuff to do. We've been putting it off so long. Alright, so he is not by this one. And... We'll ride to the top and see if he's up top. Huh? Topes. You around? You alive? Let's see, the other... The next grace fire is just, like, right in here. Stop it, wizards. What, aren't y'all happy that I sent Topes back here? Uh... Yeah, sure, we'll just warp here. Save ourselves a few fights. We'll bounce around, we'll see if he's here. Uh, no, but I didn't really expect him to be at this one. Uh, next in line would be the schoolhouse classroom. Let's try that one. Um, nope. Not looking like it. Uh, next one to check, perhaps the debate parlor. This is kind of the one I'd have my money on. I'd be really surprised if he... Got himself all the way up to Renala's place. Just seems really unlikely, but you never know. 
Tobes? Bud? Uh, hey, Your Majesty. Sorry, just looking for a... Friend's not the right word. Um... Nope, nothing. Okay, I'm sure he's around here, or he or his corpse is around here somewhere, but I don't feel like spending much of today looking. We will come back, and I will do a more thorough check down the road. Heck, maybe he didn't even make it all the way. Maybe he just, like, took five steps, tripped, and died. <laughs> but who knows? We'll find out another time. I'm going back here. This danger zone needs exploring already. So first, there's just like a little range here that's still on the map. So let's uh, poke our head in. Actually, we might be able to reach... Uh, actually, that may be inaccessible, but we'll, we'll see. Because we kind of got like... This cliff face here. And maybe a thing we could use to jump across? Oh yeah, we could do this. We could do this. Ooh, that's big. Hold up. Am I hearing something? Can't tell if that was outside or in the game, but I think I heard something. I think it's these things wanting to kill me. Also, there's this mountain of whatever the heck it is. Hmm. Like, that's gonna wake up, right? It's totally gonna wake up. Let's fight these first. They're right here. Hi, what's up? Tyrannosaurs. I guess you're kind of dog-like, aren't you? you? You got, like, more of a rat tail, though. Okay, there's more now. Yep, yep, yep. I see ya, I see ya. Gonna have to take this one carefully. Very carefully, indeed. Okay, there's one. Heavy attacks do great against y'all, if I time it just right. Alright, let's focus on the weak one. Boom. Almost gotcha. Ah, it's got your attack in just a hair earlier than mine. Oh, boy. Whew. A little bit close there. Ah, too early. Whew. There we go. Gotcha. Now for your friend. Or boss. These white-furred ones always seem to be, like, the leader of the pack. Not for long, though. Nope. Yes, there we go. Get out of here. All right, we got one of those big crow things up there. A lot of them down here. Are, are those... Those are T-rats. Okay. Uh, I will accept calling them dogs of a sort if someone can come up with an equally entertaining Tyrannosaurus Rex pun. I can't come up with something off the top of my head at the moment. But if someone comes up with one, then I will switch immediately. Hmm... Is a lot of them clustered in and around here. I should top off, get a little regen going. Okay, it's what, like three, four of them in there? Maybe just three. That one woke up and started attacking a lot sooner than I thought. But I think I got one of them. Nope. But I will soon. Ah, oh, how are you still alive? 
Not for long. There we go. Oh, jeez. There we go. Gotcha. Tough things. And... Oh, come on, that's it. Boo. I bet I could climb this. Gotta be careful, though. There is a big... crow thing... up here somewhere. There you are. Huh. Quite a vantage point. We got another tower there, but that's probably not where the tournament's happening. I'm still betting that place. We got a shack up there. A few of these towers up and around here. Interesting. Something important looking in the distance over there. There's that big white dragon thing I'm still a little nervous about. Hmm. You do have a shiny. And here you come. We have been spotted. Don't bite, please. Ow. Careful. Ow. Chipping away. Don't do whatever you're doing. Don't, don't, don't. Eh. We're okay. Gotcha! There we go! Whew! They're fightable, but tricky. Sacramental Bud. That's new. Okay. Uh... Show me this thing. Uh... An immature bud containing fresh blood, a material used for crafting items, believed to originate long ago from a strain of buds cultivated with youthful sacramental blood. Hmm. That does not tell me a lot, but this is... kind of a blood zone, isn't it? Seems like. Blood and fire. How do I get down? Safely. Obviously. Okay. This'll work. Oh, yeah. This'll do fine. So, on the map, we're out here now. How far does this stretch over this way? This far. Then we hit cliffs. And that is where we emerged from the Shifra River. Shifra. Shifra. Dang it, I'm never gonna get it right. That's where we emerged from that elevator. There's that grease fire down there that we lit. So we can get down there and presumably run through this canyon up to whatever's all up there. But I kind of want to, like... Yeah, I kind of want to run through all this stuff. See it all. There's no need to rush. That said... 
I do kind of want to be stupid and check out this dragon. Oh, and also this. Is that just the sound of these guys all emerging? I'm going to assume yes. And collect all the stuff. Carefully. At least you guys aren't the self-destructing type, huh? All right, let's attempt this jump. Uh, where was it? Here we go. Yeah, no problem whatsoever. We're on this side now. At Grail's Dragon Barrow. Wait a minute. How? How close are we to the cathedral, Garank's Cathedral? And when is that waking up? Because you know it's... I mean, it could be dead, but... Come on. When has that stopped anything from doing anything? Ooh, grace fire. Gee. I mean, it might be dead. And, like, not attacking kind of dead. Maybe. So... Okay, we're pretty far away still, honestly, from, uh, from, yeah, the Bestial Sanctum, but I feel like that was the same zone name. It's interesting, maybe, like, maybe Kaelid is, like, this kind of stretch, sort of, and then once you get further north of that, maybe it gets to, like, kind of this other, like, Grail... Dragon Barrow, or whatever it was called. Maybe it's sort of like the Weeping Peninsula, just sort of like another adjacent, similarly flavored zone to Kaled. Wait, I see glowing. Ah, uh, oh, a ghost. Hey, ghost. What's up? I'm dry. Dry as a bone. Fool dragon, surrender your strength. Let me feast on your heart. Hmm. Is there another dragon you're seeing that I'm not here? Does it live up there? Oh, wait, there's a dragon. That one's alive for sure. This one, I'm feeling a little less confident about. And I'm a little bit off my exploration path here, but I am just curious and stupid, so, um... Hello? You are kind of buried. Yeah? Maybe you're, like, a kind of dead that actually stays dead. Unusual. And I'm still just slightly skeptical of it. <laughs> and we got ourselves a little minor Erd tree here and all, and that's great. But... Ooh, some of these have, like, red eyes and stuff. That's a little scarier. Whoa. Dragon just knocked down a tree off in the distance. That was neat. Anyway, uh, let's go back. I got plenty of other things to explore right now. We will be here in due time. And we're back in Kaled. No. Okay, these definitely are dogs of a fashion. We just... We gotta come up with a good name. It's gonna be hard to beat Tyrannosaurus, but... I believe in you. Alright, we got another, like, firewall. These are interesting, and this one's broken in places. 
What were these for? What were they built and ignited to achieve? Hmm. Okay. Ooh. Got us another grace fire and got us, uh... Several things. Several things. To look at and talk to. Hello. You. Please. I can read them. Your fingers. Please, your fingers. Yep, knock yourself out. Oh, oh bless you. Are you one for festivals or flowers? I take both. To the south, a grand festival to make the stars turn. Ooh. To the east, the heart and butt of a flower to be. Hmm. But dare you enter into the heart of the scarlet rot? I mean, I'll probably have to eventually. Don't you go acting like I have a choice here. Uh, let's see about our telescope view. And we've already got some pretty good views here, but... Okay. Big swamp that we got a little bit of a preview of before. Um, I recall a dragon of some fashion waking up and being cranky down here. That might be... Eh, no, that's roots. It's in this general vicinity, though. Dragon woke up. Got cranky. Chased me. Okay. We got a keep of some sort up here, and that's interesting. Um... Kind of some open, nondescript fields here, but I bet there's something of interest hidden in it. I haven't looked at these ruins yet, have I? The ones just underneath this sort of entrance here. I don't think I have. That's one we should look into. Here's the ruins I have looked into pretty thoroughly. And then I've been kind of like wandering around all this... I just realized these are huge skulls. Whoa. Skulls of big things. These mountains is skulls. Corpses of enormous somethings. Just out of control in size. That's very cool. Is it the blood of those things that's basically soaked this land through? Yep, there's another one. That's awesome. This is one metal location. There's probably what we're trying to get to. That's where the tournament's gonna happen, I bet. That's my bet. Okay, we have a lot to do. Starting with... There we are. So. There is more up here, though. Like, stuff to explore here. Yeah, let's start with all that. There's you, I see you. And I won't start nothing with- nope, you do have a shiny up there, so... It looks like I'm starting something. Or just stealing from you. That's also fine, honestly. 
I've fought a few of you now. I'm sure I'll be fighting a lot more. Are you guarding something interesting? Can I have it? Yeah. Gotta be careful where I find my off-ramp here. Okay. Oh. It's a neat little nook of semi-safety I just fell into on accident. Yep. Okay. Look out. Keep moving. It is cool how, like... Traditionally, in these sorts of, uh, grim fantasy settings when you've got, like, uh, bodies strewn about fields and crows perched atop them, like, pecking at them and eating, uh, usually regular-sized bodies, regular-sized crows, having these enormous ancient giant entity- okay, giant entities- having also enormous wrong-looking crows on them. Pretty darn good. Doesn't mean I feel like fighting all of you crows. You can go away. Oh, and hey, a uh, red-eyed dogosaur. We'll go with that for now. Seems like I can get in some lucky hits that- whoa, hey. Kind of staggered you there. But I can definitely get in some lucky hits on horseback, so let's stick with that for now. You're next. Where are, oh, there you are. And Dunsies. Awesome. Okay. Let's keep running around. I feel like there's going to be some caves or something they're hiding around here. At the very least, there's the ruins to look into. Uh. Hmm. You know something we should do start of next episode? Uh, is take that to- oop. Where was that? Ah, above. Delightful. We should get the emote we got from Topes and take it to those places where we know to use them. Now. How did that miss? Come on now. Ow. Just gonna stick near you, keep hitting you. Yeah, oh yeah, that's the way to do it. Gotta be careful, you could easily get unlucky and take a bunch of damage doing that, but uh, it does seem to have difficulty targeting you on horseback. Okay, we can call in a friend here, and we should. Who should be the next, uh... When we try out. Lone wolves have had a shot, so have the warhawks, so have the land squirts. Sort of. Marionettes! That could be fun. Go have a little play, marionettes. Oh, you're the archer kind too? Ah. Now this actually seems like it's going to be a good time. Come on, break. Alright. So what's guarding the Forsaken Ruins? Oh. Hmm, okay. Be spending one of those in a bit, looks like. Was it just the big crow? Oh, there's another one. Okay, there is another one. Come on down! I got Archer back up! Uh, Archer back up. Team. That was your cue. The signal was Archer back up. Yeah! Open fire so much! Yeah. Stop dodging. Stop hitting my Archer back up. <laughs> it was really satisfying to watch, actually. Ah, just out of range. I'm kind of liking the marionettes. Yeah, you done. Y'all are great. And I haven't leveled you up at all. 
Okay. Now that that's out of the way, let's explore a little more thoroughly. Hmm. Not seeing anything else yet. Yeah, pretty empty. Here's a shiny. And that might be about it. All right, well, come on, team. We're going to go look down here. Let's see what we find. Y'all are coming down here, right? To defend me, just in case it's a boss of some sort. Archers. Oh, never mind. It's just a chest. But is it a mean one? Nope, we're good. Sword of Saint Trina. Something about that name is real familiar. Okay, so we've got a kind of like quality slash intelligence sword here. Causes sleep buildup. Interesting. Silver sword carried by clerics of St. Trina. Is St. Trina the name of, like, the flower, some of the flowers and stuff that we've been finding that, like, maybe it can be used for sleep status effect stuff? I bet it is. Inflicts sleep ailment upon foes. St. Trina is an enigmatic figure. Some say she's a comely young girl. Others are sure he's a boy. The only certainty is that their appearance was as, su as sudden as their disappearance. Unique skill is Mists of Slumber, releases a faint purple mist that spreads across a wide frontwards area, inflicts the sleep ailment upon foes. Okay, so purple means sleep then. All right, I'll have to watch for that. Cool. All right. Cool little find there. Hey guys, what happened to backup, huh? Or do you just sort of like stay planted wherever I summon you? Is that part of how you guys work? Uh... No? But you do seem mostly interested in staying where you are. Eh, I guess there's nothing to shoot. Okay, yeah, there. Trina's Lily. Knew it sounded familiar. And I guess we're done with this one? Yeah, suppose so. All right. So, let's see. What all's getting hit out here? What's fighting? It's a dogosaur and... What are you fighting, guy? Some sort of troops or skeletons, maybe? Let's see how this plays out. I'm definitely not fighting all of them. And now I'm here to finish the fight. There we are. So, what were you? Oh, you were, that was like, uh... The stone digger troll guy, wasn't it? I think. Hmm, and here's a new brand of knight. And there is a grace fire I've not found yet. Awesome. Okay. Let's go collect that. Oh my. Hmm. Um, 
Yeah, let's go ahead. Just to get that FP back. So we've kind of swept through and around here. Hmm. I wonder what this little, like... It looks like script almost, right? Like a little strip of text across here. I wonder if that's just, like, old map markings or if that's something of interest. Here's the burning wall across that I saw. I think I've looked at most all this stuff now. At high speed, admittedly, but still. Yeah, let's, uh... Let's look into this situation. Got a bunch of knights. One of those tanks. Just a whole mess of fire and lava and who knows what. More knights. Yeah, come on. What are you doing? Hey! Are you throwing explosives? You are. You're not very sturdy. That's nice. That is encouraging to see. Hmm. Just these interesting barnacle growths are intriguing. Hey there. Next. Oop. Didn't see you. Ah, jeez. Careful with the fire, bud. Careful with the fire and the swords. Both things. There we go. Huh. Oh, that was a death. I accidentally hit one of the things. Alright, so they've clearly been having some issues with the Dogosaurs. Relatable. Intrigued by what's going on with this keep. Hey, guy. Uh, don't really feel like fighting all of them for no reason. Yeah, let's get closer in and watch out for these camps. Who else is here? Hello. Hmm, you looked a little different. What was that? Hello? What was that? Huh. New? No thanks. Keep that fire to yourself, please. Hmm. I see you back here. Hmm. All right. Anyone else? Hello. Hey. Guess I don't need the healing right now. What? Am I triggering traps or is someone casting something at me? I see that bugle, don't you dare. You okay, alright. Nope. Wah! Didn't see you there, bud. Okay. That's someone shooting, I see. All right, all right. We'll do this then. Ugh. Rough.
Not having a lot of luck with this melee fight here. It seems to me. Alright, got one. Next. Come on. Yeah. They're not sturdy, but... They can dish out a little hurt. All right. Ooh, Radon soldiers. So that's who y'all are. Hey, Archer. That's enough. Thank you. Quite enough of that. Wow, that really does chase you, huh? Yikes. What all is happening up here? Please stop. Yeah, it keeps chasing you. Yikes. Don't like it. Where'd you go? I think you went off the cliff, but you're not dead. Stop it. I don't got time for you right now. Yeah, see this? This is why. Thin this herd. Where'd that archer go? You. Stop it. Woof. Okay. All right. Starting to feel a little safer out here now. Whew. Okay. Not seeing any grace fires, though. I think I'm going to need to get inside this keep to find any of those. Alright. Well, I guess I could look around the outside a little bit, too. Carefully, though. Very carefully. Yeah, not that way. What about the other side? Hmm. Anything of particular interest? There is a fire. Ugh, okay. Let's be sneaky about this, because this is two of them, and that's a lot. Oh, crap. Got in one free shot, though. That I will take. All right, one's dead. That's a relief. Get in them hits. All right. Oh, geez. Look out. Fire, fire, fire. Lots of explosions and fire. Die. There we go. Whew. Ah, geez. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Whew. That could have gone a lot worse. Flame, grant me strength. Yeah. Okay. In a minute, Flame. Whew. Yowza. That was scary. All right. We got a spell. Flame, grant me strength. Tell me of this. Okay. Raise physical and fire affinity attack power. Ooh. A superior incantation of fire monks creates an invigorating fire within that enhances physical and fire affinity attack power. This incantation does not burn the caster, and so it's considered forbidden by the Guardians of the Flame. <laughs> if it doesn't set you on fire at least a little bit, they don't want to know about it. Cool spell. That I could see making a lot of use of. I remember someone in comments at some point mentioning that uh, certain buffs do kind of overwrite each other. I'm wondering if, like, the physical attack boost from Golden Vow and from uh, Flame Grant Me Strength would kind of overlap in that way. I can sort of believe that being the case. I'm curious, though. Oh. This is, um, quite locked. Guess we're going around. Or maybe not. Uh, is this a mistake? 
I don't know if I trust you. Well. All right. Walk careful. All right. This is kind of something. Hey there. Do not. Thank you. There's a ladder. Anything else before I go up it? No. Awesome. Okay. We got our entrance here. Ba doop 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 doop. Hello, anyone up here waiting for me? In Fort Gale? That's cool looking. And not a little threatening. I'm gonna stay up here first. If I can. Uh, I'd love to be able to get across before that guy comes after me. Turn around. Turn around, go the other way. Go on. You're not going to, are you? Uh, it's come to this. Sneak ever so carefully. Wow. Inattentive. Satisfying, though. Let's be very careful with this one. Because that thing's probably real dangerous. Nice. Turn it around. There we go. Okay. Yes. Yellow. There we are. Come on. Let's get you before your friend gets here, because they look stronger. Oh, yeah. That's a shield. Okay, you do bounce off, though, huh? Usually. Not what I meant to do. Here we go. Now I'm ready. And you're done. Not even a problem. Cool shield, though. Oh. Hey, ghost. Convene the festival of war. Honor General Radan with a warrior's glory. It's in your hands, Sir Jaren. Hmm. I'm taking this ghost. Scar Scourge, uh, Star Scourge Heirloom. Sounds like a talisman. Is a talisman. Uh, raises strength. A talisman engraved with a scene from a heroic tale raises strength. The mightiest hero of the demigods confronted the falling stars alone, and thus did he crush them, his conquest sealing the very fate of the stars. Cool. Rather excited to encounter this Radon. Even though it'll probably be a boss encounter of sorts. Still looking forward to it. Oh. Well, that's nice, I suppose. Hmm. Uh, folks in comments have said that, like, where these are pointed does not necessarily mean anything, so I can't make any assumptions about where this might lead me. What's more... I do kind of want to be able to open the front gate to this place. So what I think I'm going to do is try to get down to fight the big thing. And get Aurelia in on this, if possible. There's not really just a ladder, is there? Well, there's one over there, but can I make that jump? I probably can. Let's 
So like, if we tread carefully. It's a bit scary, but I think that's a doable jump. Yep. Yeah, okay. And this is nothing. But there is a ladder. All right. Well, we can go ahead and uh, summon a friend if we've got the FP for it. And we do. And she can go ahead and start uh, opening fire on this thing. I don't have enough FP, so let's fix that quickly. And let's get down there. I wasn't ready. All right, it's tough, but not unbeatable. It is big, though, and strong. Whew. Keep poisoning it. I don't know if it's, like, weak to that or anything, but keep doing it. It's cool looking, though. Cool, like, lion of an enemy. Stop it. And you're done. There we go. Good work, Aurelia, and thank you. Lion's Claw. Neat. It's cool sounding. Aurelia, you're the best. Best backup I could ever ask for. All right, first this. Rune Arc. Nice. Let's look at that Ash of War before I forget which one it is. Uh... Lion something... Here you are. Uh, let's see. Grants affinities and skills to an armament. Uh, grants an armament with a heavy affinity. Lion's Claw. Skill of the Red Mains who fought alongside General Radon. Somersault forward, striking foes with armament. I bet that's the, uh, Artorius flip attack thing. That's my guess. Cool. Anyway, can I open this from the side? No. Hmm. Maybe there's controls somewhere that I can do something with. Or maybe not. Hmm. Can't mount up in here. Well, let's finish checking the place out. There was like a shiny over there. Yeah, like you can get over there apparently. But how? Hmm. Okay. Uh, jump careful. Yeah. Okay. Walk careful. So I can just drop down there. And maybe that's the ticket, honestly. Let's try that first. Yeah, we're here. Uh, there's a chest. That's something. A guitar. Cool. Uh, kind of thought this might lead to more. Yeah, how would you get up there, I wonder? Hmm. Does this break? It does. That's a jump I can make. Okay. Furthermore, maybe there's a drop. Uh, no, I think the jumps are the ticket. Oh, yeah. Uh, jumps! Boom, there we go. And... Uh, okay. Mushroom, but also I thought I saw something else shiny around here. This, here we go. That's probably opened the gate. And then out here. 
nothing. Okay. I think we are now ready to try that warp. Oof. Not enjoying all the precarious running and jumping I'm having to do to get back up here every time. Glad it worked out. All right, where's this going to send us? Place we've already been. Some other nearby area. Or somewhere wild. Let's find out. Uh, well, still in Kaled. And... Ah, okay. Might have just sent us straight down toward our destination. And now we got another warp here, too. Where... Honestly, like, I'm not wanting to be here just yet. If I can find a grace fire here, that'd be the best. Because, yeah, like, this looks like a whole another uh, legacy dungeon of a place. It's got to be a grace fire around. Come on. It's real empty out here. I just feel very exposed. Could try doubling back over the bridge. Meh. It is smoking a little, though, and historically that means things. Grace fire, grace fire. Come on. Come on. I'm not asking much. Just a parking spot. And the amount of empty I'm seeing out here right now is just kind of starting to feel a little suspicious. Really? Nothing? Like, I could get in there, but that... I'm not seeing Grace Fire there either. And I'm not trying to get inside right now. Excited though I am to scope this place out. Oh, fine. Let's check out the building. Weirdly empty out here. And this looks like a siege tower. Yeah. Starting to get some pretty beefy smithing stones, though. I guess I don't need a grace fire out here that badly. It's not that much travel from <laughs> where I've been before. I can certainly get here again without too much difficulty. Oh, oh, was I under the chain? Um... Torrent? What's up, bud? It's a bit of a drop. Hopefully a safe one. Eh. Yes. Torrent? There we go. I'm seeing bats. Oh, 
I'm just gonna go back across the bridge if I can now, if it's not too far down. And it might be... Well, here, well, let's test. do 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 Well, yeah, I can land there, but I don't... I don't think that's gonna count. When I'm falling. Fine. Go away, bats. You two. Go on. Unless you know where a grace fire is. I have no conversation for you. Hmm. It's just a little foreboding is all. Come here. Ah. There we go. Uh, cool. Cool move. Um, let's go up. Um, sure. Is this gonna open? Nope, not from this side. Alright, we're climbing then. You know what? I'm gonna get out of this combat encounter and I'm just warping out of here. I kinda wanna save this whole place for later. Kind of experience it all together, you know? There we are. Okay. I think we're in the clear. We are. Great. Let's just go. Hmm. Wasn't even really one that close to here. Well, we'll just go back here. That's fine. Or, yeah, back here, because I kind of want to check out this little stretch before I start going back down the road. This is enough for today. We've seen some cool things, done some cool things, almost got ourselves another level. This is a fine place to stop, and we'll continue our exploration as well as a couple of uh, Lyrenia backtracks that I mentioned earlier next time. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you Thursday. Goodbye.